hi guys so this episode on forex for beginners is about how to use mt4 and how to use mt5 so i'm going to start to start with mt5 so if you don't have this application you can download from google play store or if you're using iphone from iphone store if you're using a laptop you can download from the same site it's there for pc so this is what you see when you open an mt5 account so when you tap on the screen of mt5 this circle appears you can from this point you can appreciate m1 m5 m15 this is the mobile version by the way so m1 m5 m15 m3 h1 h4 d1 w1 mn and then there is f there is a cursor settings and then objects so m1 up to mn moving on m1 m5 up to d1 w1 mn that th those are time frames so it's we've got our one minute m1 five minutes 15 minutes 30 minutes one hour four hour daily weekly and monthly then we've got our function so what i'm going to do <coughs> uh, then also looking at the top we've got those three lines which are horizontal we've got a cursor we've got function which is the same as this side this f and that f is the same this cursor is the same as that cursor we've got dollar signs these are the pairs which you can see these ones that's why you if you click it's the same as clicking the looking at the bottom row the top and down arrow then the second one is charts balance a timing you can time whether last week withdrawals last three months or these days it didn't now it doesn't do well when you try to then there is the news and then there is the messaging messages from mql5 so here you can appreciate the balance if it's a live account if it is a live account you can appreciate that withdraw sign the top and down arrow shows the time order especially if you've got an open trade and on the top that one with the plus that is for execution so we can either have market execution or use sell limits sell stop for this you can research on other videos on how to use or I'll make a video on how to use a buy limit so f is for insertion of indicators so indicators are grouped as trend oscillators volumes and bill williams indicators that's the main grouping on the mt5 gap application for mobile mt5 application for mobile that's the function of f then the settings you can change the most people prefer candlesticks and candlesticks including myself you can use line chart You can use bar chart. We can return to candlesticks. Then 
on settings you can put show period separators so period separators you see there is nothing there's no no vertical lines then if you put now vertical lines just show period so if you're in a daily this is the whole day so v10 was in an uptrend you can actually use you can color your background so yes that's it for the settings then the objects list you can add so under objects that is triangle round and square under m1 you can add so there are lines channels i don't know what g-a-n-n means fibonacci elliot so you can appreciate shapes then uh, the if i talked about for editing indicators this is just for you can use it to calculate pips but like i said some other platforms they allow you to calculate using um, points so what you are seeing is points there Mm, settings i talked about 15 minutes we know that if you open a 30 minutes time frame it means that to form this one can do these are candlesticks by the way so for for that one can to, to form it depends on the time frame so if you're in a 30 minute time frame it means it took 30 minutes for one candle to form if it's a five minutes it took five minutes for one candle to form if any one minute it means it took one minute for that one candle to form if you're in four hour it means it took four hours for one candle to form daily it took a day for one candle to form then you can add windows then if you move to this side you can appreciate other things about settings this is how you add charts just click there and everything appears smoothly thank you guys thank you guys for watching this is episode five thank you guys for watching this was a nice setup and stay tuned on the channel guys more things are to come